Hello, welcome to Hikate's Crossing. Okay, so groceries arrived. So let's have a look. I want to show you some things that I got were a bit different. First thing I got, oh, wrong glasses. Okay, let me throw this out here. You can have a look at what I got. Um, and I'll explain a little bit in a minute. But... So you can sort of see. Just, just let me get my glasses so I can read what everything is. Just to give you an idea, I just picked up my sunglasses because that's what I was wearing when my groceries arrived. So just give me a second. trip up the steps. Now they've changed the countdown bag so it's different and interesting. Okay. Oops and I just knocked down all the decks from this morning from the seasons of which so let me just pick those up because I don't want to I really have to tidy up. What happens when you live in a caravan? Everything's so tiny. Right explaining. Right a few things. I've sort of changed what I buy in my groceries. So if you've seen some of my grocery videos before, you'll see that these are quite different um, ingredients. Okay, so I did get a treat for myself. Now this is called Bite Me Gluten-Free Brownie. Um, the little pieces, lots of little pieces. They're like 150 grams, very light. Now this is gluten-free. It's called Original Foods baking company bite me gluten-free bounties so i got that to try now the other thing i wanted to try a bit different is um plant cakes and i got extreme kumra now quite expensive for what they are i know but i did it's a plant i want to try this it's called natural abundance plant cakes extreme and this is kumra Okay, and kuma is like a sweet potato. These are actually made in New Zealand, so I quite like this. So there's no preservatives, additives, and it's a source of fiber. So I do want to have a look and see what the ingredients is. It just says kuma with coconut oil, coconut sugar, um, desiccated coconut, brown sugar, cacao powder, chia seeds canola oil and Himalayan salt okay so that's interesting so let's have a look at what the gluten-free um, bite me brownie oh oh too tiny to even read all that there okay I'm not gonna go into details yet okay so you can see are my treats you might find some other things in here too now I've got the angel food Dairy free, dairy free block mozzarella alternative, and this is made in New Zealand as well. So it is a dairy free block of mozzarella. I like putting it in all sorts of bits and pieces. So is that to try? Okay, so I get the hummuses, the kitchen. So I get a bit of, this is hummus, hummus with garlic, so yeah. Now the other thing I'm getting at the moment, which I'm really enjoying, are the different Bean Supreme range. So this one is Parmesan Red Onion, totally vegetarian palm oil free. So these are vegetarian. And Parmesan Red Onion Sausages. So I'm really looking forward to sort of trying these different foods. Okay, so let me put them back in the bag so that I can do the next. Show you what else I'm getting. Yeah. Uh, some things I've been getting regularly, like that cheese I've had a few times, the hummus I've had a few times, the different sausages I've had a few times, but the cakes and that were a bit different. Now, what I've also changed to is a gluten-free bread. 
Now, I did want gluten-free um, English muffins, but they didn't have any. And so what they've given me is another packet of um, gluten-free and dairy-free gourmet buns. Okay, so I've got the Vogel buns as well. So I've got two packets of them when I would normally only have one plus uh, English muffins. So I'll do what I would put on the English muffins, I'm going to put on the buns, so no big deal. And of course the sausages can go in the buns as well. Now, the other thing I've got here is a caramel steamed pudding. Okay, and it's also gluten free and I get two servings of those. That's my treat for the week. Okay, that's my treat, so that'd be a couple of nights of having that. Don't worry about the um, oh, handy towels. Just need the toilet paper now. Don't worry about Savlon pads and cage free eggs. I've got cage free eggs. I like them. I like I get a nice big 18 pack there. Now what I have been getting is a range of gluten free biscuits. So this time I've got cream. I haven't had that one before, the cream chocolate one. Now I have every, um, I have been getting this, and this has been really good at night. It's a rest, it's nature's way, restful sleep. And you can add it to still or sparkling water, but I also like to add it to a bit of milk, a bit of soya milk or almond milk or um, thing. But this has got, um, with lemon, balm, chamomile and passion flower. does say to add it with water but I don't know it just doesn't when I see the chocolate it's like I need to add milk I don't know why that's me for my bedtime right now I'm trying something a bit different to have on my toast is bread and butter cucumbers to add to my toast and my buns so that's gonna be quite nice with my sausages I think and I quite and I've been enjoying but this one's a bit different. It, it's um, apricot with mango. I have been having apricot, but uh, mango, but this is apricot with mango, which is quite nice. And that's a baker's spiced New Zealand apricot with mango. Um, or oh, just some normal soups, some veggie soups, creamy vegetable, creamy mushrooms. They're great to add to other things. And I quite like putting them over fries. I don't know why. Didn't need to get any fries this week because I've got enough of that. Now, I do get a lot of bit of tuna. Like I said, I'm just sort of changing up my... I like to get things that are a bit different. But these things I've had before. I get these different ones, lots of different flavours and that. I got some onion powder to add to my recipes and things to add to my food. Look, I've got rice and I've got pastas and I've got all those things to add and some frozen chips and that. So every week is just to get a few extra little bits and pieces. Now, of course, oat milk and soya milk is in there. And I do get the vanilla flavoured, so good one as well. Okay, so that's my groceries. I know it's not very much, is it? And there's a few things I thought I had ordered, but didn't. And maybe forgot. Because I only have so much money, and with some of the extra things, they're a little bit extra. Okay, so that's this week's groceries. Um, I've already got a lot of little bits and pieces that are going to keep me going for the week. This is just to sort of top up and just to add a few little different things to my groceries. So that's it for this week. Don't forget to check the links down below. Check the links on my channel. Like, subscribe and ring the bell so you know when the next video will be uploaded. Take care and blessed be.